Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. All I have to say is go sends go. You have the Rhino, you have Fuck the, the fucking... Fuck the Senators. You have the fucking average Joe here. The average... What do you mean, the Joe? average Joe? An average Joe? The yeah. average Joe. You're not even Joe anymore, you're just average. Anyway, below Joe, average Joe. respect <laughs> the fucking paddle, okay? He did it himself. Anyway, maybe this... they didn't make shitty fucking pumpkin beers. It wasn't shitty. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> this is a beer that was actually <laughs> sent for Joe... This is uh, from Three Floyds. This was sent from Ewert. Yeah, thanks. that's right, Ewert. Yeah, thanks, Ewert. Oh, honestly, appreciate the beer and the other one that you sent to Shed. Uh, it doesn't have the ABV on here. Three Floyds doesn't ever because fucking Three Floyds it. doesn't think you should know it. Quickly, um, is Ewert, Ewert, you know the ABV? Ewert, 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 Ewert. Who's Ewert? Anyway, Maloco Milk Stout. Oh, let me zoom in on that. Sorry. Maloco Milk Stout. Like Clockwork Orange kind of shit. Looks awesome. Yeah. I love me a milk stout. I love you a milk stout. I don't know what that means, but okay. Ooh, that looks. Can we stop, please? Yeah, that worked out well for her with the Domain Pinnacle Cider that night, too. Christmas. Hey, Booth. I was at Domain Pinnacle Cider. Okay, what is this bullshit? You pour a oh, little I got bit. the same. Okay. All right, <laughs> bigger, dude. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. You're welcome. That's black. Mm. That's beautiful. That, that is, is nice. definitely... Yeah. And that head is nice, too. It's a nice, deep brown head, even. Nice, thick head. Yep. Hmm. Way more roasty than I anticipated. Can I smell it on the bottle real quick? And then we'll pass it on. Thank you. You can pass it to the... Alright, more subtle lemon, out of the bottle. Like, let, lemon I don't know what you thought. What you think? More yeah, subtle it out actually of the was weird because usually you would expect the bottle to give you yeah. more yeah, flavor. Well, scent. But no, it's not. More it's, roastiness uh, out of the glass for sure. Kind of I at like least thought Roasty and, and the lactose sweetness is coming yep. out Sweet, on. roasty. And that's really all it is, is sweet and roasty. Resinous, not really, though. No, not at all. <laughs> Alright, let's get into it. It smells like a typical milk stout, but we'll see how good it tastes. The clockwork orange. I taste orange. some that's orange candy. Right that's the clockwork orange right there. Oh, that's so smooth. I love yeah, you, G. I love you. Um, e, I'm not, I'm indifferent. The clockwork orange is some weird shit. Yes. That is so smooth. Unbelievably smooth. It's like Maloco milk smooth. Mm -hmm. Biggest ninja did, did, did devil's chat? Mouthfeel and the body on this is absolutely the phenomenal. With the scent? Yeah. Oh, you saw that already? Oops. Um, oh, your glass yeah. This is a this very is nice, mm -hmm. smooth beer. Really nice. yeah. It is almost as smooth as the uh, Nitro Milk Stout from Left Hand without the Nitro. You're about right here. Okay, Did you bring it down a level? Okay. Um, <laughs> the Left Hand Milk Stout, because it is a Nitro beer, is right ridiculous. Right but it's far... I mean, I will give Chad that this is not a Nitro beer, and it is exceptionally smooth. But the flavors are way more robust than the left hand because it is a nitro beer. You kind of lose. Like, oh, yes. As soon as you want the regular one, the non nitro no, beer. Oh, it's beautiful. That's a little whiskey. bit more on par with this, but um, this is much more. I'm waiting this for is, a minion. It's just so chocolatey and yes. so lactose filled. I mean, the sweetness is there. And you're not it's just the sweetness that takes over your whole mouth. And the roastiness. Uh, it's there. The roastiness, it's dialed back oh my God, the, the roastiness helps catch the sweetness that you would get from the lactose, at least. I like it. Mm -hmm. I'm sold on this beer. I really yeah, like it's it. it's good. I really like it. Um, what would I give it, though? Uh, I mean, we could keep talking tasting notes, but you got it all there. Roastiness, lactose, and chocolate. Well, compare it... Well, it Compared to the left hand milk stout nitro, I think the left hand for me is better. And I'm not saying just as flavor, but the nitro adds an element that smooth while this is smooth, it's something about the nitro. Yeah. But it, this isn't a nitro, so it, it, we can't it, really it, hold it, it against the nitro just, beer. That's true. Forget what I said. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying that this is close to nitro smooth. It is for not being a nitro. This is so smooth. Out of 10, you. I love it. Eight for me. Eight. I've, only, I've only had a couple milk stouts, but that's right up there. It's great. Anyone else tried it? I would say a seven five. I enjoyed it. Shit, the pants likes a beer. Hey now. 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 Hey now.
Ow. Nah, just giving you a yeah, she, I'm, I'm trying to egg her on until she beats my ass. And then <laughs> she'll just tell I'll you do a review with a couple black eyes. Just be like, hey, you're a tube. She won't do that. She'll just tell you the score of the hockey game. Motherfuckers, that's yeah. worse. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to know. Out of 10? That's what five, Buffalo ten. lost by tonight. By 8.5? How the fuck did they lose by 8.5? <laughs> I don't know. I don't watch hockey. Fucking dab is buzzed. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. You clearly don't. I'd give it an 825 out of 10. In my, all honesty, I'm between the 8 and the 825. I would actually buy this. Uh, not that I'd ever find it because it's a fucking three floyd beer. <coughs> but it's a really nice beer. Thank you very much, Ewart, for yeah. sending it. I Thanks a lot, Ewart. Yeah. This is a great beer. I, I'm glad I shared it with everybody because... Uh, that's a you beer you definitely need to This was a serious share. good share beer. Yeah, for sure. A really and I, I love my very fancy uh, glass from Five so, so let me ask you a question because we're going to veer off in a different direction. Um, three Floyds, two beers you've had so far. What do you think of them? Live up to the hype, a little bit below the hype, above the hype. Who the fuck cares? They're very good beers. Anytime you get an but eight, fuck, it's living up. Fuck that hype that I hear all the time about them. Okay. So fuck you, you are, even though I appreciate the beer. <laughs> I wonder if they actually know what a fog is. 